Well, as major sports leagues across the country target times that they can come back, the XFL telling all of its employees today that they'd been let go and the league doesn't look like it's going to return for 2021. Tough news for all, especially DC Defenders head coach Pep Hamilton. They'd had a great year. Hamilton is a Charlotte native. But feel-good stories continue to pour out of the sports world, and they all seem to involve being a part of something bigger than yourself. Here's a story about one team at Davidson College. You're not sweating together, but you're sweating apart. It's just a reminder to work as hard as you can. I'm not promised to be able to play you know, a Division One sport. I'm not promised to be able to go run a 5K. College athletes across the country took part in a virtual 5K this week called Last Shift. It was held to honor seniors in spring sports whose final seasons abruptly ended. Sent out the registration to the whole team, talked to the coaches, and everyone was on board really quickly. The entire Davidson field hockey team taking part. I'm just so proud of the way that they've all kind of approached this and stayed connected. I think it kind of reminds me that there's there's a bigger picture out there. The Wildcats took the streets of wherever they lived, Kentucky, Texas, and New Jersey, of course, in their Davidson gear. Someone in my town whose son plays football at Davidson saw me running and was like, hi. Proceeds from the run benefiting the Headstrong Foundation to support those affected by cancer. Thousands of images flooding social media the day of the run with the hashtag last shift 2020. It just made me like really happy and I really felt like, yeah, like even though we're so far apart, like this team is my home. Seeing everyone's stories was just like making, like reminding you that like you are doing things with your teammates, even though it's not side by side. It has been really sweet to see the way that people have responded. And there is some good news for those spring sport athletes, the NCAA granting them an extra year of eligibility to return next year. We'll be right back.